Welcome to the Gary Abbott Budget Watch YouTube channel. I have three of my favorite Pagani watches that I acquired all of them in 2023. And I'm going to start off with this Omega 007 in blue. Uh, no Time to Die 007 watch. Uh, it is a 42 millimeter. Uh, it does have a clickable bezel, which works really well and uh, clicks nicely. I highly recommend this watch. This watch comes in uh, two different movements. You can get it in an NH35 or you can get it in a Miyota. 8215 and it really is a really nice watch it's all stainless steel stainless steel bracelet uh, 100 meter uh, water resistance really a nice watch looks good on the wrist the only thing is the 14 millimeter uh, size, uh, height wise, it does run a little high on my wrist. I like 42 millimeters. I have kind of a larger wrist and it does look really good on the wrist. There it is on the wrist. And you can see how it sits up a little on the wrist so it's definitely not one that's going to fit well under a dress shirt unless your cuff is a little bit bigger um but it really is a nice watch it looks good on the wrist i like this band this band looks good it is interesting that the dial blue is a little bit darker almost in some instances looks black, but it is blue. Uh, just isn't the same blue as the bezel. So that's my uh, really number three watch. My number two watch, which is the Rolex Explorer Homage by Pagani. And um, this is another excellent watch. This one kind of surprised me as an automatic movement. It has a AR coating. So it looks really clear, which I think is a very big plus. We'll call it a 40 millimeter diameter. It's 39.7 technically. No, it is a 12 millimeter height. So it fits really well on the wrist. I guess that's what I'm really trying to say. This watch I thought would look too small on my larger wrist and uh, it looks good. It actually looks really good. It looks really good. I think Pagani got this, uh, the style looking really great compared to a Rolex Explorer. This is my number two favorite watch in 2023. And my number one watch is the Rolex Explorer Homage by Pagani. Um, I like this one. This is a 42 uh, diameter. That is what the, if you were to buy a real Rolex Explorer would be. Uh, the bezel looks great. I didn't find any sharp edges. It's a GMT. It sits well on the wrist for being a not anywhere near the height. Of the uh, 007 watch, but just look at that thing. You got to like it and the and the date window lines up really well. You've got to like this watch. I, I think 
This watch is a little more expensive because you can get it in the NH35. These watches are not the NH35. They are Pagani's um, automatic watches. And I think they keep really good time. So I'm not having an issue with that. And I like the looks of the two of them. I do think the AR coating is better on the uh, this uh, Explorer version. But I, I personally like this white dial and the GMT. That's my favorite watch. Hope you've enjoyed watching these videos. Uh, and subscribe and like to my channel. It would be appreciated. Hope you've enjoyed watching my uh, my top three.